Oh, I would love that, B.A. I don't mind dressing up in a sweatsuit, but I know TV requires a coat and tie, but I would love on occasion to have a dress-down day if we could. Inside. Edmund, good. Hey. Say some ball movement there when you pass the ball like that. Good things happen. The Bucks shooting only 29% since the fourth quarter began. Here's Robinson. And the layup is good Just off the glass. Robinson's got nine points here in the second half. He's showing a lot of confidence in his ball handle. Going to the crossover to free himself up. Ooh, I love it. Ooh, it's stolen away. Works against out of the Kubo. There's a minute 54 left in the game. That one, no good. New York has gotten six of 13 shots to go from outside the arc. MP outside. To the middle. Here's Deadman. Another possession. Another assist. That's another dime from him. He's tallying them up fast, B.A. Pass to Diakite. Basket counts. It's safe to say they have dominated this game. The game wasn't even as close as the score says in a great win for the Knicks. They made a point to get some good looks. Yes, they were able to pound the ball inside. I love it. And this will give them their 28th win of the year. And clearly they have this team's number. Winning the first two meetings, nothing left to play against the Bucks. The Bucks making a switch here. Connaughton's checked in and featuring Kobe Bryant, Tim Duncan, and Kevin Garnett. Is the 2020 Hall of Fame class the best ever, Clark? Well, I'd certainly have to go back and look, but there won't be any classes that would be any better, I would say that. I mean, clearly, depending on when some of the all-time greats went in and who were part of their classes in the past, but I would be hard-pressed to imagine or be able to state a class that was better than this particular class. 2009 comes to mind. Michael Jordan, David Robinson, and John Stockton. That's a pretty good reason to show. And he drops the first for the number 14. At the line, two shots. And both free throws good for MP. Milwaukee has got just one of six threes to go in the fourth. Here's Connaughton. There's 45 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Outside Robinson. Just five on the clock. Shoots it from the high post. Misses off the right iron. This is why you want ball movement and player movement. And that's made it hard for the defense to key in on any one individual. MP, the pass to Noel. Picked it out of midair. Oh, deflected. It's stolen by MP. Mm. And there's the lob. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley-oop attempt. Pass to Connaughton. This one by a big margin. We saw two different teams tonight. One played with confidence, operating flawlessly. The other just looked lost. And the energy in this building was awesome. The crowd was involved from the jump. And once they started to really pour it on, it was fun to see how it all came together. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Grant Hill, Allie LaForce, and Clark Kellogg, this is Brian Anderson thanking you all for tuning in tonight. We'll see you later.